Lesson 12. Objective. Solve multi-step word problems using the standard addition algorithm modeled with tape diagrams and assess the reasonableness of answers using rounding. Problem number one. Solve a multi-step word problem using a tape diagram. The city flower shop sold 14,594 pink roses on Valentine's Day. They sold 7,857 more red roses than pink roses. How many pink and red roses did the city flower shop sell all together on Valentine's Day? All together is an important word. Box in how many. And then it says use a tape diagram to show your work. So box in use. So first, I know they sold 14,594 pink roses. So we go ahead and make the tape diagram for that. This shows the pink roses sold on Valentine's Day. Next, I know that they sold 7,857 more red roses than pink roses. So we would come down here and show our red roses have the exact same amount plus 7,857 more. So here's my pink roses sold and here's my red roses sold. And this total value will equal R. This will be my variable. So now I must add all three of these numbers together to get my whole. Part plus part plus part equals whole. So first you add up your ones column. 4 plus 4 plus 7 would give me a sum of 15. So put your 5 in your ones place and your 1 above your tens place. Next, add up your tens column. 1 plus 9 is 10, plus 9 is 19, plus 5 is 24. So put your carrier 2 above your hundreds column and put your 4 in your tens column. Next, move to your hundreds column. 5 plus 5 is 10, plus 8 is 18, plus 2 is 20. So put your 2 above your thousands place and your 0 in your hundreds place. Next, move to your thousands place. 4 plus 4 plus 2 is 10, plus 7 is 17. Put your 1 in your ten, above your 10 thousands place and your 7 under your thousands place. Finally, we add up our ten thousands place. One plus one plus one will give me a sum of three. So your final sum is thirty-seven thousand forty-five. Remember to always restate your question. The city flower shop sold thirty-seven thousand forty-five pink and red roses on Valentine's Day. Finally, let's check to see if we have a reasonable answer. 14,594 rounded to the nearest thousand place would be 15,000. So then we automatically know that 14,594 rounded to the nearest thousands place would also be 15,000. And then finally, 7,857 rounded to the nearest thousands place would be 8,000. Add up your ones column and you get zero. Add up your tens column and you get zero. Add up your hundreds column and you get zero. Next, we move to our thousands column. 5 plus 5 is 10 plus 8 is 18. Put your 8 underneath your thousands place and carry your 1 to your ten thousands place. 
Finally, add your 10,000s place. 1 plus 1 plus 1 would give me a sum of 3. So our final sum is 38,000. Now, 38,000 is very close to 37,045, so I would say yes, this is a reasonable answer. Thanks for listening today. See you tomorrow.